advice Look me in the face Tell me that you love me Even if it's fake Cause I don't fucking care Hey everyone, welcome back to this brand new video here on the channel of Game Time Life. In this video, I will go ahead and show you how to merge Colored Body Armor after late patch of 1.45. So let's get straight into it. Now first of all, you have to go ahead and do this glitch with the outfit transfer glitch. And basically we have to go ahead and transfer multiple outfits in order to complete it because we have to merge. So you can only choose the delete character methods. I will link it in the pinned comments because links in the description do not work for some people. So I will make a pinned comment with the link to that video. Alright, so what you must do before you go ahead and create these components if you're not familiar with this glitch. Delete your second character, create a new one, make it a female one and once you're in an online session, hit find new session and make your way over to the closed store with your new second character. Now because these are female to male components, you have to make sure that your main character of course is a male character. So once you got that all set, you can go ahead and create the components. Now I'm going to show you a variation in this video with the purple body armor, but you can also get the orange or the green armor. You cannot get the pink armor because it's currently not savable. Alright, so we can only go ahead and obtain the color with armors if we can go ahead and create the components for it. So I will leave the components for the color with body armors in the description. So choose whichever color that you want, but for example, I will be using the purple body armor. So first of all, I will be creating a full outfit with this. You only have to go ahead and put on the following items that I'm telling you. So on outfit slot number 1 you want to create the following outfit, you want to make your way over to the fitted suit jackets and put on any of these boating blazers. We're going to be using the armor only so it doesn't matter which one of these blazers you're using, I'm just going to be using the cheapest one which is the black boating blazer. So actually what this fitted suit jacket will do, if you hold down your touchpad and go to inventory body armor, you will see that you get, can get all kinds of these CEO um, armors. So basically these armors will give us the colored armors if we transfer them over. So like I said, I will go ahead and be using the purple body armor. So um, if you want the purple body armor too, put on the heavy armor. If you want green armor, put on the armor that I have linked in the description. So once you have the armor component on that you want, you can now go ahead and you know save it. You can put on like some pant components. Because I'm going to be using yellow Tron pants on my final outfit, I decided to put on these Tron pants right there and I just put on white sports shoes components. So also, because I want to make it a full outfit, I will also be merging race gloves in this outfit. So my Wi-Fi was gone for a second, so I'm back um, here in GTA 5 Online with a new second character and with the same components. So we're going to continue with this video. Alright, so on this outfit that I'm wearing right now, I'm going to be putting on the merging gloves, which are the Lies Woodland Tactical Gloves. I'm going to be merging yellow and purple gloves on the end result outfit. So if you also want to go ahead and put like merging gloves on um, this outfit, then you can also get racing gloves on your end result outfit if you want to, of course. So now, once you got your outfit set like this with the merging gloves or without them, just go ahead and save it on the very first outfit slot. All your outfits will be removed so it doesn't really matter at the end. So now once you got your base outfit ready, you can now go ahead and, you know, create a next outfit where you of course want your um, merging armor. Where you want your merge armor on top of. So I have two options right there, I wanted to see how it looks with like the white fest shirt and a black t-shirt and the black fest shirt with like a white t-shirt. So um, yeah, just go ahead and create those components for yourself. If you want to go ahead and you know have the same components as me, just go into the pants section, go to the leather pants, put on the black ribbit leather pants. Now for the tops, you want to go ahead and make your way into the bust shirts first. Those will be the fast shirt components. Now here I have the teal lace posture, which will be the white fast shirts. 
So now on top of that I have a sports jacket which is the white camo bigness puffer and it gives us a black t-shirt. So um, for shoes I am going to be putting on the deluxe midnight combat boots which are the white sports shoes. And also what is very important if you choose to do race gloves go ahead and put on those same light woodland tactical gloves. And in order to make sure that the color with armor merges of course put on the heavy body armor this one is essential. Now if you want like different top components it might not work with all the tops that you want to transfer and have the color with armor on so keep that in mind not all tops will work but this one will work for sure so put on the heavy armor to make sure that you can merge the color with armor over. So that was option number one with the white fast shirt and black t-shirt I also have option number two everything stays the same just the fast shirt and the top changes. So if you want to have like a black band fast shirt, go ahead and put on the white lace bust here. And then for the sports jackets, go ahead and put on the dark blue guffy puffer. And again, make sure you have that heavy armor on and your merging gloves. So those were the two outfits that I'm going to see how it looks together with like the gloves on them. And then, you know, we're all ready to go. So if you have this outfit ready right here and you have your components outfit ready with the heavy armor on and maybe the race gloves components, all you have to do is put on a standard outfit and make your way outside the clothes store. So now we're going to be doing the transfer glitch. I'm not going to show you that in this video or else it will take too long. I will go ahead and leave it in the pinned comment like I said on how to go ahead and do it. So simply go over to the pinned comment, go ahead and do the outfit transfer glitch then come back over to this video so I can tell you what to do next. So once you spawn back in with your male main character, first of all check if the outfits have transferred over and as you can see they are here for me. So now all you have to do if you have the merging gloves on, just go ahead and put on the race gloves of your choice that you want on the finish it result outfits. And if you did not apply any of these um, race glove components, you can go straight over to Crooked Cup. You can find it under the versus section of the Rockstar Created Jobs. So now once you're at the Crooked Cop settings screen, make sure you set clothing over to player own it. Hit confirm settings and invite players so you can go ahead and start it up. The rest of the settings do not matter in this case. So once you've got players who can go ahead and help you out, all you have to do is hit play. And then once you're on the settings screen where you can go ahead and choose your outfits, Scroll over to own it outfit and go once to the right and you should see your color with armor with like, you know, a racing jersey underneath. Go ahead and ignore that. Then go once to the right again and you should see that the armor spawns on the outfit. Now I have the option number one here with the white top and here I have option number two with like different like this. So I think option number one looks the best. I don't know if you can see it the best, but I would just go ahead and save this one first of all. So once you've got that outfit on, hit ready to play and wait until you load into the job. Now once you're on the job, you will be wearing that outfit, so all you have to do is hold down your touchpad, go into style accessories and go once to the right to put on a rebreather and to make sure that it saves once you are back in free mode. So then just simply go ahead and pull up your phone and quit Crooked Cop. And once you spawn back, you can now go ahead and make your way over to the clothes store or to the emanation to save up your finished outfit. And once you got it all saved up, you can now go ahead and customize it the way you want it. So this was basically the tutorial on how to merge color with armor. I hope you guys liked this video and I hope to see you back in the next video here on the channel. Please subscribe and turn on post notifications. Bye everyone!